And according to CCPD, the victims from that shooting are just four out of 11 hurt after a string of shootings that took place across the city over just this past weekend. Now, Chief Mike Markle saying a huge concern for their department is how these weapons are getting into young hands. Our Alexis Green joins us in studio now with that report. Alexis. That's right, Rudy and Leslie. Chief Markle told 3 News that out of all the weapons that they recovered from this weekend's mass violence, seven handguns belong to people not old enough to legally own them. He is stressing the importance of securing your weapon because they have already seen several stolen weapons this year be used in violent crime. I'll tell you, just last week, uh, we had 13 guns stolen out of cars here in, here in the city. That's 13 guns that can end up in anybody's hands, juveniles' hands, uh, bad guys' hands. We sat down with Lieutenant Brian Hager, who says if you like it, lock it, because thieves are out there waiting for you to slip up. Where do shoppers go? They go to the mall. So where do these thieves go? They go to where they can get things readily available and quickly. Uh, guns, they know people keep them in, in cars. People get complacent. Uh, it's definitely a place where bad guys are getting these, these guns in their hands. Lieutenant Hager says there is a right and wrong way for those carrying legally to secure their weapons. Ultimately, we would like for nobody to leave their guns in the car. Take the gun home, uh, put the gun up in a safe place, don't leave it in your car. Uh, but there are aftermarket safes out there on the market to where you can uh, lock your, your gun in a vault, per se, uh, and lock it underneath the seat to where it's uh, more secure than just leaving it behind glass. Chief Markle also wants to clear up some misconceptions about how old you need to be to own a gun. Um, honestly, 21 years old is how old you have to be to purchase and, and, and hold a handgun. So we hope that parents understand this and people understand that own a weapon, that's fine, but secure that weapon. Lieutenant Hager says this year alone there have been 263 guns that have been stolen from cars. He also adds that it's important for owners to know those serial numbers so that way you can able you can accurately report them stolen and then that way law enforcement can help track them down. Back to you guys.